Brock sure did quality work with that, but I can prove it. Ought to make Odin's spear look like a toothpick. Even pointier than before. I'm always getting new stock. I suppose there's no putting it off any longer. You better get to the Temple Bridge and rendezvous with the others now. Ready when you are. The armies are probably gathered in their home realms, waiting for when we blow Gallarhorn. Guess I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin won't believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Rousing speech, brother. Very inspirational. Wow. The Valkyries look different. Welcome back. Hildesfini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. Well, what would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that, they are reborn. Corporeal and uncorrupted, thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. That gives us an advantage by air, and with Hell's army for a vanguard. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him. But there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Well, when you say it like that, why worry at all? Sigrun! It's good to see you so... Alive. Oh, yes. I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen, the shield maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, Amir, please excuse me. Oh. Good night, then. Freya. Have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing. A leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim. And the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. This is our invasion. A siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced wartime general in the field. 
I don't care about the honors. I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just sleep on it. Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Mine? A young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? I do. Wow. Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. Together, we took them all down. There must have been a hundred. I don't know, maybe more. Spare us your gloating. Does it really bother you that some of my ideas actually work? No, but... I do envy you. <laughs> In what realm? Spare me the patronizing. I've calculated every risk I've ever taken. Tried to mitigate all the ways it could go wrong, and still... It all falls apart. You, you just throw yourself into situations in harm's way, and somehow it always works out for you. You always end up all right with that stupid grin. I'd argue my trip to Asgard didn't go quite so well. Yes, there are some lessons to be learned by Kenny, and others by learning to adapt. That's why you two were such a great team. I'd argue it's because we had such a lousy old man. Sorry. It's true Njord was not much of a father. But he's the reason we were able to be a family. Yeah, funny you should be so hard on him, Freyr, since you inherited his wanderlust. Especially in times of importance. That's not true. I had good reason for leaving those times. Tell her. Ah, I have missed. Are you nervous, love? I'm nervous. What if they don't accept us? What if they don't follow us into battle? I mean, in their eyes, we're an abomination. And how is that our problem and not theirs? The Uniter has spoken. That should be enough. They will follow. And if it's not enough? Then I will make them. <laughs> that sounds like the elf I fell in love with. You're shivering. I'm cold. We can leave for Alfheim now, if you want. No. No, I'd like to stay here for as long as we can. My apologies, but I would like to be alone with my thoughts. We will leave you to them then. I don't know what tomorrow brings, but if tonight is our last night, I'd like to spend it feeling something besides hate. Will you tell me one last silly story? There's nothing I'd like more, except perhaps a dance. Yet do I may have lost a step? Hmm. 
Due respect, love. I don't tell silly stories. You only tell silly stories. <laughs> I can never argue with you. Can I sleep here tonight? story. If I fall asleep, promise you'll finish it tomorrow? Of course. Now, close your eyes. an old man who chopped wood for his village. Every evening he wore the logs on his back and delivered them to his people. But the logs were heavy and he grew weaker as time went. And one day he threw down the logs as he could no longer bear their weight. And he, he called for death to come to him. And when death arrived, He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of humor. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. 
She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home. Does my request upset you? is a natural part of life, my love. I wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. Mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me. You are quiet. I have nothing to say. Well. Say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. The funeral pyre. I would have chosen different. Oh? <laughs> In my land, we entomb our loved ones. You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort. Mm. You once tried to take charge of your ending, did you not? That was different. Circumstance, yes, but not on purpose. <laughs> you prepare for a distant future. There is much time ahead of us. I wish to better a future that will exist without me, whenever that day comes. For you, and for our son. <sighs> we will always walk together, Kratos. You will always be a part of me. I will always be a part of you. And when you are gone, that part of me dies as well. I do feel your absence. <laughs> Culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts to it. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. to have loved fully. Open your heart to the world as you have opened it to me and you will find every reason to keep living in it.
What's going on? It is time. I'll meet you outside, Father. Sir. you one more time, my queen. Me too. But not as your queen. As sisters. Are you ready? Yes. I will be your general. It will be an honor to fight alongside you, general. Aye, brother. I'll be right by your side. So, what are your orders? To the temple. storm in Asgard and, and whatnot. I thought you could make use of it. Indeed. Feller need. fits. thinking of course you got your armor all set just go win that's all that matters oh do you think it wise to go off without stocking up you may never get a chance again i'm 
so sorry that was dark. General. Sir? General? General? Sir. Hey, bud. Uh, General. did not lead us here, nor will it win this battle. Wars are won by those that are willing to sacrifice everything. If that is the cost of vengeance, so be it. Odin has taken so much from us already. The realms have suffered enough. No matter the cost. This ends... today. If going out in a blaze of glory means that Odin burns too, might as well be. A big, fat smile on my face. For Brock. after Niflheim next. They're trying to shut out Ragnarok. We've got to stop those war machines. Not an ideal start. Work to do. You three, Paul, Atreus, Freya, with me. Watch our flanks. To the war machines. This 
Valkyrie Queen is gone. I would think so. Then we must hurry. Behind you! It's coming! Giant Giants made it after all. The snake looks different. He is different. But when I was away, uh, 
Uh, never mind, later. The Ain Heryar's link to Valhalla. My sisters and I must sever it. Go. Still no sign of the dwarves. Sindri won't let us down. We have to trust him. Rally all you can. We will make for this fall of Huntawa. <laughs> I'm late. Where is your army? No more dwarves are dying for this. Save, Save it! Odin forced them to build those war machines. And I'm here to tear them down. Before you break them, we must turn them on the wall. Fine. Leave it to the dwarves to clean up after the shine. what you wanted I, I didn't want this no close your heart to it close your heart who are they my guardians Odin took them in they shouldn't be here they're not soldiers Odin put them in our path to die. It's war. Wars are won. By those who are willing to sacrifice... ...everything. What are you doing? Does your mother's
Lord's wish. And mine as well. Today, sir. Today, we will be better. But what can we do? See the size of that thing? I think we're gonna win. I mean, if they don't kill us first. Why have you stopped? Ragnarok is here. We finally have Odin right where we... We will stop Odin. But we did not come to sacrifice the innocent. We will breach the wall at Rinto's flaw. With what army? Petraeus and I will be enough. That's suicide. It may be. But we will die seeking justice. Not vengeance. Can that weapon break open the flaw? Only one way to find out. You three. Get those people to safety wherever you can find it. We will see it done. Frey and I will do what we can to slow Ragnarok. He was not by us before. See if he will listen to reason. <laughs> Odin will not get away. If he does, so help me. I know. Valky! No! No! Protect him! I will help those that are trapped. And meet you at the wall. Go! Go, Atreus! Sentry! Be careful and stay behind me! You be careful. I'm here to fight. Arba 3! Look, can I just say? No, you can't. Shut up and fight. Who's for No, I just want... I don't care what you want. This change is enough.
really had me believing you that we didn't have to be enemies. Dude, you're okay. My mom was right about you all along. You're a killer just like your father, and you're here to kill us all. No, just Odin. <laughs> Sindri, go! She's a friend. Friends don't bring the end of the world to each other's doorstep, Loki! You're right. You're right. I, I made some bad decisions. You do that a lot. I'm not sure that's a defense. It's not a defense. I just want to make it right. Is Gilder okay? Have you seen him? Why wouldn't he be? What are you talking about? Odin is willing to sacrifice the Midgardians. He put them along the wall to try and deter us, knowing they can't fight. Their deaths are just meant to slow us down. Why would he do that? And how am I supposed to believe you? Because... he's right. It's who Odin is. It's who he's always been. Mom, why are you here? What... He'll sacrifice anyone at a problem with one of him. The Guardians. Your friend. Our family, any of us. I had hoped that your father would stand up to him, but now it... It has to be you. Mom, what are you saying? Throod. I never doubted that you would make the finest Valkyrie these realms have ever seen. But not for him. Do you understand? Our family. Without Odin, we can be one again. A real one. What he's doing is wrong. He said if we held our ground, we'd be safe. He said we owed him. You don't owe him your death. <laughs> no shit. Dad will never let them get their grandfather. Then go with him. He'll listen to you. Are you ready to go find the rest of your people? Yeah. I love you, Mom. I love you too. Finally. Is not whole. What remains 
purpose is incomplete. It cannot fulfill its purpose. Wait! Where'd Sentry go? He has done his part. The rest is on us. I felt that one coming. Perfect! 